those dunks were uh, pretty spectacular. Am I right? Do you guys want to be as spectacular as me? I would only assume yes. So, come hit some plyometrics with me. Here's a, a pretty intense plyometric workout that's bound to get you bouncy. And, and remember, just like all plyometrics, unless you're jumping as hard as you can, I'm not gonna say useless, but I am, just for the purpose of making you go harder. Let's go. A lot of people use like resistance bands for these, but this is all I got, so you guys will get the gist. And always, before I do depth jumps, I start with depth landings, which are about as fancy as it sounds. Also, something that I think we all get into a bad habit of is uh, doing the same workouts over and over and over again and expecting a different result, AKA, you're driving yourself insane. The goal of training, always, is to, like, cause adaptation. But, I typically jump off this, but today we're going to do a 40 inch drop. Pretty much gonna jump, tap, get back down, tap other leg. I go for around three taps each leg. Let's do four sets. So four sets of six total jumps. I like this one. Personally, I just kind of rest until prepared. Rest until ready to give your max effort, which for me is personally like two minutes. All right, and last but not least, we're gonna do a broad jump into a box jump. Uh, push yourselves as always. I always like to be over dramatic and optimistic about my broad jump. Um, as you can see there though, be careful. Uh, I'd really appreciate if you guys would subscribe and share this with someone and like it. Take it easy guys.